getting a new t-shirt today. Apparently she's being really late. Yeah, super late. Yeah, and I just got my fur done. What do you think? Sweet, babe. Uh, it's more than sweet. It's magnificent. Okay, sweetie. When is he going to come? I don't know. I don't know. Shut your mouth and stop with the chitter chatter. I hear you kids mumbling about your greatness of a teacher, Mr. Rumptwinkle. Mr. Rumptwinkle? I meant Mr. Duke. Ugh. Quiet down, class. I told you to quiet down. We're not talking. That was talking. I told you to quiet down so many times and you keep talking. But, mister, we're not talking. See? Even more chitter chatter than before. <sighs> Listen up, mister. If you make any more noise in my classroom, It'll be the end of your family. Can you start with my younger sister? She is so annoying. Oh, I'm not doing it if you're happy about it. Now I fell. <laughs> Do you want detention? No, mister. Jud. My markers are messed up. Well, today we're going to be learning area and perimeter. We already learned that. I said no more chitter chatter. And I don't care if you little slugs already learned it. You'll learn it again. Ugh. You little slugs. So you see. Hmm. All right, we're going to need to find the area and perimeter of this problem, kids. I'm gonna give you a piece of paper. You kids probably don't know what paper is, but it was a big thing back in my day before printing was a thing. He's gone. You do not know what he'll do. Yeah, I had it for my math teacher last year. Well, well, not my math teacher, my English teacher. And he was a big, big, big meanie when it came to getting, to doing something out of line. Fine, I don't want to get hurt. Alright kids, I'm back with the papers. Now you may come and collect your papers. Let me just put them on my desk. Now come and collect the papers. Hey, I didn't call on you! You said to come collect your papers, so. I didn't call on you, as I was about to say, when I called your name. You have to wait, young man. Now go back to your seat. Before I end you. Okay, jeez. Thank you. My desk. Oscar. But I was the first one who came up, and you were going to call me. I don't care. You have to wait for me to say your name. Take your paper. Okay, jeez. I'll just get it over with faster. Here. Here. Oh, wait. Is there any unicorns in this classroom? 
um, sir, um, I'm actually part unicorn. Perfect! Deliver the um, paper with your horn. Okay. Oh, and just so you know, there will be no homework today. Yay! I didn't tell you why. It's because there was this hamster that came and chewed up all the pencils. Does it ring a bell? You know, they're vicious little tiny creatures with razor sharp teeth and they chew everything in sight. You know, like one of your classmates. Hey, um, hamster classmate, come up. Look at the sharp teeth and the razor sharp claws and doesn't it chew everything in sight? Chew it, my death. I'm not a termite. Chew it. Okay, Jesus. How dare you chew my desk? You just told me to. Why would I ever tell you to do that? Go back to your seat. Okay, Jesus. That was very rude. I didn't even do anything. You did, you chewed on my desk because you told me to. Well, you shouldn't have. Okay. Get my markers back. You may begin. Okay, time's up. Poster finished. I'll come and collect your papers, and then I'll grade them. Wait, hold on a second. Unicorn dog, collect all the papers with your magic and float them over to me. I'm too lazy. Okay. <sighs> Thank you very much. Let me grade them. Okay, kids, I have graded your papers. And I don't think your parents will be happy. You all got F's. What? What? But we got the questions right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you all got the same answers. Because it's easy. And we already know this. We're in high school. Well, I'm still not convinced you all cheated. So until I'm convinced, it's staying an F for all of you because all of you, all of you got it all right. And that I'm convinced that you stole the test answers and got it all right. We got it right because we're in high school and we already know this stuff. I don't care. Now, who wants a cookie? Me. Uh, I'm just kidding. You really think I'm that nice? No, you're evil. Oh, and I can't wait to have a conference with your parents tomorrow. Ooh, hey. You wouldn't dare. <laughs> I guess you would dare, but he's so bad. And now, since you got all the questions right, there's no lunch. Oh, come on. We're starving. Yeah, yeah. Well, I could just magic up a lunch. No! I give them to my students every day. I love Fs. And they're the best. And I love to sing about giving my students big old fat red Fs on their papers. And 
talking to the parents in a conference. And I love F. It's the best letter in the alphabet. That's why I love F. Who wants to sing it again? No! about F's, but I've convinced. Let's sing about F's, and I think I'm convinced that F is the best dang letter in the whole wide world of alphabets. Yeah, sing about F's. Oh yeah, sing about F, 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 F. Oh, I love F's. Oh, I like sing about F. I love my yeah. I love my life when I get to sing about F. F is so nice, and I love it so. And I will toss anything I can throw. Oh, so I love. F's, and I'll tell you why, because they're the best letter in the alphabet, I love F's, I love F's, Ugh. huh, what's this? Hmm? Mr. Bananas has, I mean, Mr. Duke has a big butt and a big mouth. <gasps> well, you, well, everyone here has a big F on every single chest they're ever going to get. Mm. Hmm. Class dismissed. Class dismissed. I 